Clean eating can mean a lot of different things. At Eating Well, we approach clean eating sensibly. All foods can be part of a healthy diet, but I totally understand that there's times where you just feel like you need to hit reset and get back to the healthy habits that help you feel your best. This 14 day clean eating meal plan can help you do just that. Clean eating is all about eating more of those good for you foods that help you feel awesome. High fiber whole grains, healthy fats, satisfying proteins, and plenty of fruits and veggies. Today, I'm gonna walk you through one of the delicious recipes that you can find in this 14 day plan, the Greek meatball mizzy bowls. All right, what I'm gonna do here, is, so to this ground turkey mixture, the recipe calls for frozen spinach, but I didn't have any. I did have some fresh spinach. So I'm gonna chop this up really, really finely and add it into the turkey mixture here. Too often, foods get labeled as bad or unclean. Putting labels on food like that is destructive, right? If I were to say dark chocolate peanut butter cups are bad, I can't have them. That would only make me want them more. And even as you do this clean eating meal plan, it's totally fine to have a little dark chocolate at the end of the day. It's more about just adding in more of the good for you foods. So you wanna to get to about a cup of this chopped spinach. And I am doing it really, really fine. You need a half cup of feta cheese. Yum. It's about a half cup, maybe a little more. We need about a half a teaspoon of garlic powder. This is fresh oregano. Smells lovely teaspoon of salt, a whole bunch of pepper. So our meal plan, you know, I say this often, it does not have to be something that you stick to. It is meant to provide inspiration. If you want to try following up just one day to start, that's a great place to begin. Doing it for a little bit longer can give you better insight into your eating habits. Then take what you've learned afterwards and really implement it into your daily life. Meatballs are all ready. I'm going to get them sauteing over here in the stove and I'll bring you in for a close up so you can see how they look. This is probably over medium low heat, but look how delicious those look. Meatballs are cooking away. I'm gonna get the quinoa going. So I have about a cup of quinoa here and then two cups of water. Forgot I'd turn it on. I'm gonna let it come up to a boil. I'll give it a quick stir. And then I'll put the lid on and let it simmer for about 15 minutes. All right, so the second batch of meatballs are cooking. The quinoa is bubbling away. So I'm gonna get going on like the fixings that go with the quinoa. First, we're gonna kind of start by making the dressing. Start with a lemon. I'm gonna add in some olive oil. Fresh mint, I just picked this from my garden. They need about two tablespoons worth. Dump that mint in and then parsley. We need a half cup of this. I'm gonna just cool off this quinoa because we want it to be a cold. Pop that over there. Parsley, finish this up. Okay. We're gonna chop up this cucumber here. Before I do the cucumber stuff, I just wanna add my quinoa. That looks good. Just add a touch of salt into here. Oh my gosh, I haven't had mint in a while and that is just like absolutely delicious. And now to go with this salad, I'm gonna chop up some cucumbers and tomatoes that we can just put on the side. Got my cukes, need my tomatoes. All right, now this is the best part. Obviously we get to plate it up and eat it. How easy and delicious it all looks when it comes together. All right, quinoa first, some meatballs here, some of my veggies. Sometimes people think eating clean requires no store-bought ingredients at all, but that's just not true. This is just a, a tzatziki. It's pre-made, it's really healthy, it doesn't have anything crazy in there. Doesn't that look amazing? Here we have it, the turkey meatball meze bowls, or packed up in one of these nifty meal prep containers that has this nice tight locking lid. This is something I, I certainly would not mind eating for four days. Really, really delicious. So when you check out the meal plan, 
you will see this recipe and so many other delicious ones. And if you haven't followed me on Instagram already, please do so. And let me know if you follow any part of the meal plan or if there's certain recipes that you really love. Remember to like this video, share it with friends, and subscribe to Eating Well for more awesome videos. Happy cooking, and I'll see you guys next time on Prep School.